Hey, NYP investors, hopefully everybody's ready to talk about the merge. We're going to try to keep it in the simplest format so even the slowest learners are able to understand because there's so many videos out there. I've seen some of them where they speak about it in such a complex way, people don't understand. So I'm going to keep this brief, probably like a five minute video, so hang tight. So jumping straight into it, what is the merge? The merge was initiated in 2020 and it's the equivalent to getting a large, big upgrade to your phone. To keep it simple, the upgrade was on how transactions are processed in the blockchain. Before, these transactions were called proof of work, but now everything has been changed to proof of stake. And if you guys don't know the difference between proof of work or proof of stake, I'm going to leave in the description below a link of a video I made explaining what these differences are. And the link actually might also appear somewhere in this video, I think somewhere on the top. But basically why this is very important and why everybody is talking about it is because it's going to reduce energy consumption by 99%, AKA reducing the carbon footprint. Now the benefits are that this is going to have a greater adaptation by people and it's going to be more secure. People are going to be more interested because it's easier and cheaper and also supply and demand baby the more that people are interested and the limited capacity of ethereum that you have the value will increase now talking about the two major og cryptocurrencies bitcoin and ethereum now since the merge happened there are two big differences with bitcoin and ethereum bitcoin being that it still works all the transactions through proof of work and now ethereum runs under proof of stake and there are a lot of advantages with the merge because the nfts only exist within the ethereum blockchain and ethereum is also going into the metaverse web3 so a lot of energy consumption is going into that and the merge will help people make it a smoother transition or have a smoother transition for the people and also for the environment so i promised you guys i would keep it short and simple all i want you guys to understand is the simple concept of what the merge is on the next video we're going to talk about the bankruptcies that are happening now and also t-mobile joining the cryptocurrency clan till next time